Chase it. Step. Steph. Stephanie. Hey, we need your help real quick. Sleep paralysis. <laughs> right now? Yeah, I couldn't get up. Y mira, te dije que a las once y media nos íbamos, Esther. Te estoy esperando allá abajo. What is your problem? Oh, sit. Oh, sit. Oh, sit. Me. Okay. <laughs> Ever since Second. Really? Yeah. Oh my goodness. Is this all on video? Yes. <laughs> I saw it. Now you oh. know why I called you. Oh. oh my goodness. Oh. Who all knows? Everybody but Renee knows now. Yeah. She uh, I just got off the phone with her. And she has no idea he's here. Oh Daniel.
Your prize is a very special welcome home to your daughter who just returned from a tour of duty in Afghanistan. Everyone, please welcome home Sergeant Ellen Monica.
It was a hero's welcome in Gretna. Two of our military's bravest paid a visit, spreading their message of inspiration and courage to local youths. KTV News Watch 7's Kyle Gravelin has the story. Gretna High School students bearing American flags lined the main entranceway Thursday. The patriotic presentation in place to welcome Sergeant Major Brad Casal, United States Marine Corps, and Taylor Morris, an explosive ordnance tech with the U.S. Navy. Two heroes. Severely injured fighting for our country. Deployed to Afghanistan, stepped on an IED, uh, blew off parts of all four limbs. Morris's equipment didn't detect that underground IED back in September 2012. Casal sustained gun and shrapnel wounds while protecting a fellow injured Marine in the Battle of Fallujah. But Morris and Casal overcame all odds and survived. Now they focus on our country's future. Spreading a message of inspiration and courage. You face it every day in life. I mean, you're, you're not going to encounter and go through life without facing adversity. Facing and overcoming adversity. Something Morris says can't always be done alone. You can wing it on your own, or you can, you know, look up to somebody that, uh, you know, you kind of agree with the way they did things and, and try to follow that as best you can. Former Army Captain and now Nebraska Governor Dave Heineman also spoke at Thursday's event. These men willingly and women put their life on the line so we enjoy all the freedoms we have today. Sergeant Major Casal cracked a couple jokes but left students with some sage advice before departing the stage. If you just have two things, if you use two things, this and this, if you use your head and put your heart into it, you'll accomplish anything. And now it's up to those students to lead us into the future. Reporting in Gretna, Kyle Gravlin, KETV News Watch 7.